Okay, we're back. Uh, we're going to write a little bit more code in here. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the MC variable um, and we're going to set block. Now set block places a block down. So MC.setBlock and then we're going to do that parentheses right there. And because we have this variable called P right there, we're going to be using this to locate our players um, X position y position and z position. So x dot, oh sorry, uh, I'm going to do that p dot x. So that's the player position at the x-axis. And we're going to go p dot y, so the player's position at the y-axis. And p dot z, which is the player's position at the z-axis. Okay, once we've got that, don't forget the commas there. Um, we are going to set a block down directly below our player. So I'm going to do uh, block, and you can see we've imported block right there. So there's block and there's block there. And we're going to use a block of, let's just try snow, block of snow. And don't forget to close this with the parentheses there. Okay, so what this should do now, and let's just run our program. Um, by clicking play. Now, um, let's not forget that this is saving this file over top of my lot warp file. So if you want to save your lot warp file, um, you can open a new file right here and start a new one, but um, I'm just going to use my lot warp file and it's going to save right over it. So um, basically, if I go into my Minecraft, and I'm just going to drag my mouse into Minecraft and click the button, and I'm going to look down, and lo and behold, a block of snow right below me. So basically what this did, what it did was it took my position and it placed a block of snow directly at my position. Because P, you can see the variable P here, it gets our position, and then it sets a block in the position I'm at in the x-axis, the position I'm at in the y-axis, and the position I'm at in the z-axis. And the type of block it puts down there is the snow block. So it puts a block of snow directly where I am. Now that's okay, but I think we can build something a lot cooler than that, and we'll do that in the next video.